Hey everyone, it's Haley, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a plan with me for the month of May. So as you can see here, I'm just gathering a couple supplies. Um, but as for the overview, this is what I used last month. And I had the kind of more boxy method, if that makes any sense, of um, doing the calendar. And I just like doing that because I have a more visual representation of the month and I can see when all my tests and quizzes are. Um, and then I have my daily spreads, which are rel relatively simple. Um, they just include the day of the week with the date and then I highlight it. And then I sometimes will do like a whole week and do-do spread rather than the individual Saturday and Sundays. And I actually, later in the video, you'll see that I actually included that on every spread because I liked that better because I felt like I could get more things done because I don't know I just I just liked it better um but also you can see the little boxes up at the top those are like weekly spread kind of things they just have Monday through Friday with all my class periods so then I can mark when I have a test or a quiz and I like doing that instead of having to flip back to my calendar like every single day just it's easier I think so yeah anyway here I am making my calendar for April Oh, May, sorry, not April. And I just used the boxy method again. And then I kind of messed up all the boxes up right here if you can't see. Um, but I just decided to ignore it and go on with it. <coughs> um, but these monthly spreads are kind of inspired by TV studying. Um, she doesn't do these spreads anymore, but I really, really like them when she did. So that's why I do them. I think they're really easy to do and I just really like them better. And then now you can see that I am actually doing some fake calligraphy. Um, I suck at calligraphy, but I don't know. I, I like the way it looks, so I just did this. And now you can see that I am drawing some flowers because I thought that, you know, April showers bring my flowers. I thought that'd be cute just to draw some flowers. And then instead of doing a monthly goals page, I just decided to go straight into the um, weekly kind of overview like I mentioned earlier and um, the daily spreads. Um, basically, I'm just doing the same box thing. I make five boxes. Um, one for all my class periods, and then the rest of them are for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, which are the days that I go to school. And then I have seven lines for each box, and for that I write my periods one through seven, and then if I have like a presentation in first period, like on Tuesday, I'll write that in the box or whatever. It's just basically like that. But um, here you can see that I'm kind of decorating a um, little drawing a little bit more. Oh, but then I went back to the boxy weekly spread thing and I did this, so yeah. And then here you can see that I'm coloring it. Um, I decided that the theme kind of color of the month would be pink. I just think that looks really nice. Um, I did this for every week and I liked it because I was, I liked having to, um, write out the days ahead because I feel like one that'll save me a lot more time and two I just like the way it looks like all neat and like organized um yeah anyway that's just what I'm doing now and then here I'm making a week like a weekend to do spread um I figured out that I like those better just because I felt like there was less stuff to do if that makes sense Instead of dividing it up in like two more days, I just like the way it worked out a little better. Oh, and there you can see where I messed up on my monthly um, calendar. I messed up big time on that one, so I just crossed it out. But anyway, now I'm just kind of going over the words with a marker. And then this is what the close-up looks like after I filled all in, filled my tests and quizzes and stuff all in. So yeah, it's pretty simple, but I like it. Um, yeah, and I think it looks really good. I really like the color pink. I didn't, I'm not really a big fan of pink, but I really, really liked it. <laughs> so here I have another overview. Um, I used a sticky note 
like of a little emoji just so I could easily flip back to the monthly page. And yeah, that's basically it. I hope you all like this video and thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you next week.